so I need a haircut. All right, good morning folks, welcome to this week's video. So we're back out in the woods today. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at this jacket by Fjern here. It is honestly my most favorite, favorite damn jacket I've ever had. So without further ado, let's cut straight to the intro. Right, so good morning everyone. We're in the forest today. We're gonna to be taking a look at this jacket by Fjern. So this is the Arctis 2. I've been wearing this for about a month now and I must say I absolutely love it and I wish I could bloom and sleep in the thing because it is so comfy and so warm. So there's one thing that I always say to my students and that is there's nothing wrong with criticism as long as it's constructive. And Fjern have been really, really constructive over the criticism that has been fed back to them from the customers that have brought the active down jacket. So the first development Fjern have had on the Arctis 2 jacket is the actual toggles for the hood. So let's just get the hood up and you'll notice you've got these toggles here and actually as you're pulling this piece here that's pulling that tight and that feeds all the way around the hood now that compared to the initial mechanism that we had in the active is a hundred percent better because in the active it was really really fiddly to get those uh, bits of elastic caught in the little toggles inside so the fill of the jacket is goose down it's ethically sourced it's got a 750 fill power with a teflon coating which means that it's really water resistant and very very quick drying so talking about the shape of the jacket i'm not an athletic build as you can see i blame that on lockdown but as you can see, it fits really, really well. And then moving up your arms like this with the no lift gusseted arms here, you're not getting the jacket right up your body as it were. And then also when you're bending over, a lot of jackets tend to ride up your back to show the bike parker area there. But uh, this jacket doesn't do it. Then talking about the fit of the jacket to get this fitted perfectly to your body, you've also got this elasticated draw cord hem here as well. So you can pull that out to get that nice and tight around the bottom part of your body. So as you can see from the jacket, it is very figure hugging. It's a really, really nice fit. This is an XL on me, this one is. Um, the jacket itself is really, really good to be used on its own in a very, very cold and frigid environment. Or if you want to go out in some really wet weather, it's perfect to be used as part of a layering system. So the outer fabric is ripstop nylon with a durable water repellent finish. So talking about the hood of the jacket, the hood is completely downfilled as well. You've got this really high extended collar here so that when you actually pull on your toggles here, you can really hunker yourself down inside the hood. And then of course with a collar, if you don't want to be wearing a hood, you just zip up your collar and you're tucked nice in here to stop any cold getting down to your neck. Right, so let's talk about zips. So all of the zips in the jacket are YKK zippers. You've got these long little grab loops on there so it makes it really easy if you're using gloves and you want to open your zips. On the top here, you've got this tricot zip guard here. So this is there to stop you from catching your chin or your whiskers in the zip as you do it up there. So speaking about zips, that brings us over to the next thing and that's pockets. Now the one thing that this jacket doesn't have compared to the active is it doesn't have the chest pocket on the front here, which I do like because I also find that if you're wearing a big rucksack, it's very, very difficult to get to the waist pocket sometimes. But the waist pockets here, you've got the zips, which are YKK zippers with the grab loops on side of it here. And it makes it really easy to undo and do up. 
inside the pocket really really warm pockets you've got that tricot lining inside of there so the pockets are really really warm so the other thing to talk about is does the jacket have an internal stuff sack yes it does but it's not the same as what it is on the active in the active the stuff sack was one of the pockets there but in this jacket here you've got this mesh pocket on the inside left of the jacket and that's what you're folding your jacket up into so to store your jacket you basically reverse the jacket into the stuff sack and there you go there's your camping pillow. Right then, so a quick summary of this jacket. Would I buy it? Definitely. The retail price of this jacket is £220, and that is direct from, uh, from Fjern themselves. I'll stick a link to them in the description below. It's a really warm jacket, can be used in really, really cold environments by itself, part of a layering system. It's well made, and it's gonna last you a lifetime. So there we go, so that's a review of the Fjern Arctis 2. Um, if you want some more information about that, then follow the link to the blog where there's a written uh, review on the product as well. There's also a link to Fjern below, and also there's a link to a playlist of other Fjern products as well that we've reviewed on this channel. Thank you for watching this video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, then please hit the subscribe button. And as always, there's a couple more videos there for you to take a look at, and we'll see you next week on the next one.